Welcome to the Future at the Gulf Information Technology Exhibition, or JITEX, in Dubai. The biggest and busiest event for the city showcasing the great and the good of the tech world. Now in its 42nd year, JITEX has grown from a niche specialist interest show into the world's largest exhibition of its kind. JITEX is today the only place on earth that you can go to see Companies from around the world flock to showcase their technology, their innovations, their progress. It is the biggest tech show in the world today. Um, and it really is a testament to what the UAE and what Dubai is able to do. When it takes a sector and, and focuses on it, we are focused a lot on technology. And we're seeing today that companies from around the world are believing in this and are coming to bring their innovations here to first explore new markets, but at the same time to try to penetrate the UAE market as well. Two million square foot of exhibition space makes up JITEX at the Dubai World Trade Center. It's the equivalent of 33 football pitches. There are more than four and a half thousand companies this year. A quarter of those are new. And there is plenty of competition to see who is the best. One of the wow attractions was this two-seater flying car. The futuristic Chinese prototype Xpen X2 is made of carbon fiber and can carry two passengers while emitting zero carbon dioxide. As it's designed with low altitude in mind, the city will be its home with a maximum flight speed of 130 kilometers per hour. So first of all, we start from very small multi-copters and then we gain our experience in the development. We gain the weight of the whole design and also consider different safety requirements and uh, in mitigations in our system. I think now we spent eight years at this point to commercialize in the next generation. I think we still need two or three years. So a bit longer to wait to try out this futuristic flying machine. And if you'd prefer to have your feet on the ground, the Dubai's Road and Transport Authority has for the first time unveiled its driverless taxi. The cruise origin vehicle still has a little way to go before we can use it here. But by the end of next year, we could be traveling in one of these, with thousands becoming a familiar sight on the streets of Dubai by 2023. We're going to test them in different areas around the city. We start doing the high definition mapping for some areas within the city of Dubai. So Jumeirah 1 city walk area is one of the first area that those vehicles will be tested and trial. The vehicle is actually equipped with different technologies. Those are uh, laser radar and also equipped with 360 degrees cameras that uh, gives the full visibility around the vehicle uh, while it's making the move on the street. And building on those streets could be this man. He certainly has the hands for it. But look a bit closer, and this is in fact the latest version of a humanoid by a company called Engineered Arts. Everywhere you look at this tech show, there is a focus on the future. And this year, there's a push on the metaverse. We're predominantly an experiential marketing agency. And as our brands and clients move further and further towards more digital experiences like the metaverse, we knew that we needed a way to guide them through that process. So we developed Arcadia, which is a proof of concept metaverse experience that helps brands and marketeers understand the power of this new medium. This new video service is called Room and was launched at Jitex. It creates Zoom style calls with a 3D video game twist. There is no need to download an app. It runs on a browser. Users are one click away from metaverse meetings. So imagine I'm the host. I pick a meeting room that's appropriate for the mood of the meeting, invite my colleagues to join, and then we naturally interact using the technology. And most importantly, pick up on those non-verbal cues that are so often lost on grid-like meetings. So a room is the most lifelike way to communicate with people in the internet. So what we are fighting basically is the topic of video conferencing fatigue. And so people enjoy again to be together in the digital space. People have come together in record numbers at JITEX this year. There is so much positivity around tech here as we get a taste of what life will be like in the future.